Another one, another one. These young competitive archers place second in the state. But at Perry Christian Academy, students have their sights set on another claim to fame. It looks like it was a picture taken. It's really good painting. I could never do that good. Students walk by this 10-foot-long mural at least two times a day. Most people don't even understand. I mean, you know, they think it's just something you we put up there. They don't, they don't know the full story behind it, you know. The mural is impressive not just for its detail, but for the artist who created it. This is just one of my ideas that I came up with. Is that what you want to hear? Whether on canvas or the computer, Kyle Bungie takes drawing to the extreme. He would do the characters just in minute detail. Detail that earned this 20-year-old a degree in video game design. Kyle is known around Perry for his custom-made church bulletins and precise renderings of local architecture. He has an understanding of depth that a lot of 20-year-olds probably wouldn't have because he observes. Over the years, the depth of Kyle's drawings became stronger, even as his body became weaker. Things have gotten harder, like being able to breathe and like I've had to use a breathing mask and just like little changes along the way kind of remind you that you're not always well. Kyle has Duchenne muscular dystrophy. He's endured body casts, three metal rods in his back, and most recently this artist lost the ability to lift his arms. He can't move. He can actually, he still has the fine motor. So we have to be his large motor skills that move the hand and set the paper just right. Can you move your hand? Yeah. Forward again. To the left. A little bit. Kyle's fine motor skills are pronounced, but he can't move the large muscles of his body. Can you pull my arm forward a little? So his mom places his arm to the left on different sections of the paper. As he moves to a different section, then we'll have to move the paper again. Just trying to do as much as you can. Uses what he has to the maximum and doesn't complain. It should be an inspiration for everyone. Kyle usually draws from a photograph, but on this day, we found him without a visual aid, sketching an angel. I'm just imagining what it might look like. You don't know, so you have today. And that's the day you need to make the best. Kyle's mom says she hopes her son can continue to draw. The result? Illustrations full of depth. And not just color, but context. That's good right there. That's a gift. With videographer Scott Schaefer. It just makes me proud. That's a Sarah story. Very proud indeed because Kyle Bungie passed away last month. In the words of his mom, he finished his battle with his disease. Kay Bungie says she was not ready to let him go, but never would have been. So Kyle saw an opening and took it. Memorials may be sent to the Muscular Dystrophy Association or the First Christian Church of Mexico.